Hi everyone, I'm Seth from this group of Stutter. Today, I'm going to teach you how to draw Baby Dory. Here's the thing you need. Pencil, Racer, Ruler, Scissor, Quarter, Copy Paper, Let's begin. First, we have to draw our eye patterns. Fold your copy paper in half, and with your ruler, mark two dots two and a fourth inches apart, and then draw a little line. Make a mark one inch out from the line on both sides. Draw a little curved line at the top of the egg and then down to the bottom. It will be smaller at the top and bigger at the bottom. Cut it out for your eye patterns. Using your pattern, draw the egg shape for Dory's eyes, with the smaller end toward the middle. Then, use the other pattern and draw her other eye about a half inch away from the first one. Now you have her eyes. Take your quarter and put it near the inside of her left eye and trace around it. Then do the same for the other eye. Put a mark about half an inch away from the smaller circle and draw another circle around it. Try to keep it round. Now we will draw the little circles on the top of her eyeballs. Watch me and do what I do. Now for her eyelids, draw a skinny curved line on top of her eye and then a fatter one down below. Try to make them about the same on each eye. You can erase any mistakes you want and try again. The next step is to draw a five and a half inch line between her eyes. Half an inch from the top, draw a top of her face with curved lines. Do the same on both eyes. Now, draw the side of her face with a big curved line from her eyelids down to the bottom of the long line. Make sure you use a curved line. At the top of her face, make another curved line for her eyebrows and then two more lines under these. Add a small curvy line at the top of her head and make a little fin on top with two more little curved lines. Her mouth is toward the bottom of the page. Add a curved line and put two little lines going toward the bottom. Mark half an inch below that line and make a curved line for her mouth's bottom and her tongue. Now we will draw her fins. Make a mark on the outside of her face, even with the bottom side of her mouth. Then draw a one and a half inch line for the top of the fin. 
About half an inch below, draw another line connecting them to make her fins. You will have to round the edges out to finish them. On the left side of Baby Dory, we are going to draw her tail. You need to make a curved line going up where her eyeball meets the side of her face. Then, draw a curved line down almost to her fin and connect her tail to her body with another curved line. Draw two lines on her fins like I am doing and a line down the middle of her tail. <laughs> Using your ruler, draw a line across the paper to make your guidelines for your background. You can use the bottom of her eyes to know where to put the lines. Use a white colored pencil to color in Dory's big eyeballs in the littlest circles. If you don't have a white pencil, just leave them white. Outline the circles you made with the quarters and color them in with your black pencil. With a dark pink pencil, outline the next circle and color them in on each eye. Use a dark blue pencil to make these lines heavier, and then also outline the top of her head and her little fin on top. Next to her eyelids. Color them in with dark blue on top and then outline and color the bottom eyelids as well. Her mouth is next. Outline everything in her mouth with dark blue. Then outline her face with the dark blue. Outline just the first part of the fin in dark blue. Align the rest of her eyebrow and then the sides of her top fin. Color in the sides of the top fin with your black pencil. Using a light blue pencil, color in the top part of her face. With a purple pencil, color in her eyebrows. Make the outlines a little darker. Using the same purple pencil, color in her tongue. With your black pencil, color in the rest of her mouth and then outline the second stripe on her fins and the outside of her tail. Color the third stripe on her fins and the outside of her tail yellow. Then color the middle part of her fin black. If you want, you can make a little zigzagging black lines that go to the yellow part of the fin so it looks better. Then you do the same thing on her tail. Outline her whole tail and both of her fins in black. To make the ocean background, start with a tan or cream colored pencil and color the paper under the middle line. Then above the line, make the ocean aqua or blue. With a black pencil, make a shadow underneath Baby Dory on your ocean floor. Take a light blue pencil and go over the aqua of the ocean to give it some more texture. Now you can use your imagination if you want to add shells, seahorses, coral, or anything you want to draw on the ocean floor. Maybe even a treasure chest. You could also add real shells and glue them to the background. Now we finished with Jordan's today. I hope you guys have fun. See you next time.